Okay, some people want to know what a typical day is like on the homestead. Uh, generally, uh, get up in the morning, have some coffee, and then take my breakfast, which my wife usually makes. And in this case, uh, it is the uh, scrambled eggs with salsa and some leftover corn chips that were uh, stale. They're actually still really good mixed in the eggs. Uh, really good breakfast. I will sit down with my breakfast and then I will check emails and respond to comments on YouTube. And then generally after that, I start doing some work around the property. Uh, generally just some little things such as uh, removing trees around the property since nobody has been here for some time and the uh, UPS driver was having some difficulty coming down the driveway. So a lot of overgrowth, a lot of little tiny projects that end up starting to take a lot of time. Uh, all kinds of little, little things. And then if we're lucky, uh, we get to take a fun road trip and then kind of see the area, explore the area a little bit, and then check out some of the sites. There's always uh, something to see. In this area, there's uh, curvy, windy mountain roads. Interesting parks. Uh, there's always the Buffalo River in some areas. It's just you just always run into it. And there's just uh, a lot of interesting things to see. Unfortunately, it's not all fun though. Generally, uh, we try to make one fun day a week to go do something, go check out an area.
but it's usually some kind of a little bit, my wife's working uh, remotely, so she works, you know, 40, 50 hours a week. And then I try to do the same outside around the property, just little, got a little to-do list, a little dream list of things we want done. But for the most part, it's just little projects all throughout the property, upgrades. We want to make a guest cabin so people can come and stay with us. We need to finish the uh, solar installation, the insulation for the building where the batteries are going to be in. Uh, a lot of little, just little, little things. We're still not done unpacking. I still need to go get the animals. I'm probably going to do a solo trip uh, one of these days. Just run out there, run back. Uh, just a lot of little, little things. It's, uh, I wish it was all just sitting, looking at the uh, mountainscape and drinking my coffee, but unfortunately <laughs> it is not. It's actually, uh, life's a little bit busier now than when I used to go to, to work to the office. You go to the office, generally I would sit there for, you know, 10 hours a day, just sit in meetings and just chit-chat with people. And if I wasn't in a meeting, it was just chit-chatting with people around coffee. Oh, and that's really a typical day. It really is no typical day because my tomorrow will be different than today and yesterday was different than today. So it's, uh, it's just interesting because it's still hard to believe that this is just normal. This is my life now and this is, this is what I do. So it's still uh, interesting on that point. I need to go get a drink. I've been working for a while. I need to drink some more. The bugs are not that bad today. There's like one bug buzzing by my face and it's gone now. And I don't, this is one of those little bugs that does nothing, doesn't bite me. It just hovers in front of my face and it's just annoying if anything else. Until next time, thanks again and uh, thanks for watching.